All right. All right. We are streaming today. And that we are. And we are doing Genshin. Um, I don't have a whole lot planned today. Other than just kind of playing and chilling. Um, I'm pretty sure like there's some fun stuff we can figure out and find to do. Wander around the world. All that fun. Fun jazz. That's the goal today. Um, just messing around. Um, and yeah, like we might switch over to a new game. We might not. Let's see where this day takes us. I still need to fix that. I keep forgetting that I need to fix the, in that area, but we're fine here when we're doing this. Uh, nice, claim all. Dude, I, I'm aware of Mantis wine. So let's go to the teapot. Let's start there. Then we got the weeklies I noticed. There's probably some dailies. Oh my. Wait a minute, do I have no I don't have Farina out yet. Okay. That's okay. Ba 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 ba. No, that's not. That's already. Oh. Okay, that's fine. Go to Realm Depot. Um, I'm kind of also working towards like, cause I want to create my teapot and really create it. But I'm going to try to get as many of different things as I can on that department. Um, so by the time we get there, I can make whatever I need to right away. These are all still babies. Okay. That's what I thought. Already done those. I think that's what I need. I think that's the last one I need. Please tell me that's the last one. Yes! Finally. It's the last one I need before I can do the uh, Sumeru quest, the quests for the pre the Gourmet Supremos in Sumeru. There's still a couple of quests I need to do in Inazuma. But I think I'm going to probably move the daily quests to Sumero. 
um, for a little bit just because I can. What brings you here? Hmm. Um, Zudong is working on new dishes and Parvana is giving him ideas. Zudong told me that he wanted to make a sweet and soft dish for dessert based on Inazuma's tricolored dongo, but it would take several special ingredients to do so. Uncle Munasia, Munahisa, Munahisa, went to town to buy some lavender melons. Melons. I'm going. I'm here to gather what they call sakura blossoms. Although I have gathered some, it's still not enough yet. I wanted to go search ahead, but it's crawling with monsters. Traveler, please, could you please help me bring three sakura blossoms back? I've got it. Thank you. Okay, cool. It looks like there's another... A nice challenge that is now complete. There's a treasure chest way over here. Ugh. Okay, sure. That's one. That should be number two. Where's number three at? Thing is down below, but I did not see it, so we're gonna try looking at it from this angle. There it is. Go back and talk to Julie. Yep. There you go. There you go. don't want to do any more of those because those are not um but now that I've gotten that done I should be able to go do oh uh, within our duties where is that one located though okay that one is in Sumeru over here at Port Armos
think it's this way. Just wander around until I find it. Because unless I have to do like a daily reset, that could be. I don't know. I guess not. Or something's over there. It's gonna be something else though. These two. Okay. Hi. Bye. Oh, looks like the dead. Yay! Ah, so this is Sumeru. What are you sniffing? <laughs> Didn't you say Sumeru has a lot of spices? I don't smell any of them. Spices are sealed in warehouses. How can we even smell them at the harbor? Whoa, that's a huge one. Is that the divine tree that holds the academia? Does it bear any fruit? Hmm, maybe divine fruit. Oh dear. There's no such fruit. If researchers feel hungry when reading, they pick some of these some, some of these fruits. If we have canteens. <laughs> Everyone, there's no point in staying at the port. Doesn't Miss Parva Parvana have some business at the academia? We should head off now. Can't afford to waste time. You came to Sumero too? Ah, didn't expect to meet you here. It's been a while. Are you here to look for ingredients for some tasty food? Sort of, but before we start to look for any, we need to run some errands with Parvana. Actually, it's my paper on Omnispice. I finished it and I'm about to report it to the Academia. But you guys don't have to come with me. I'll catch up with you after this is over. A bunch of people are flooding into the Academia. They wouldn't... They would have thought I was hijacked. Are you feeling embarrassed now? Huh? Why would I feel embarrassed? Mm, mm, mm. That's a good drink. There's nothing fun in the academia. All you can do is wait for me there. That's alright. I've always wanted to go to the academia, but I've only heard about it from people in the guild. Miss Parvana, Mr. Zudong, was just worried that you would run into something, something sticky. After all, you've been away for too long. No one knows what would happen on your return. Mr. Kame, 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 Mr. Kame gets me. What are you even talking about? My tutor is too nice to make things difficult for me. I've been in contact with her. She's already, she's read my draft. I'll just have to submit the finalized version this time. That'd be great. You could just take us as tourists. <laughs> they just want to go in so bad. Going to the ad academia for a tour? Seriously. Come if you want. I should be able to get over with it in no time. And after this, I'll take you for tasty food. Don't worry. I won't forget. Yay! Traveler, you should come with us. You offered so much help. Now it's my turn to treat you in Subaru. Time to dig in. Then let's get going. It should take, it should take a while to get to the academia from here. Oh, it's really far. Okay, before I do anything else, I'm going to go ahead and move my daily quest lines to Sumeru. <coughs> what? What? 
So it'd be lovely if only someone was around to take a picture for me. Great, I wish... Yeah, my husband and I are stuck in an Azuma. Due to the Sakaku degree. But those days are over now. I love the color on that dress. We are finally able to travel to Sumer. Ah, the very thought of being trapped in one place for too long. I told my husband that we should visit this various places here in Sumer to rack a little. But he claimed that he was far too busy clearing his work backlog. He would not go out the door for the world. So so there we go. That's why I'm here all by my lonesome. And wouldn't you know it, no one was available to help me take some photographs. I had wanted to take photographs for my husband to see as well. But since you're here, traveler, I may ask you to help me take some photos. Sure. All right, then. I'm counting on you. How will this angle do? Should it be a bit more centered? Okay, I'm ready now. Take a photo. Hmm. If you finish taking the photo pictures, let me have a look at them. Oh, wonderful. My beauty is indeed as radiant as ever. Ha ha! Even more so than before, I'd say. Oh, you and your silver tongue. Still, thank you, traveler. Come, this is your reward for the pictures of me. Here you go. Okay, cool. Let's, we're gonna, where is it? That one. We are gonna go back in and do the, those ones. Being I'm in Sumeru, I have to have very specific. Oh, what is over here? Um, because I've got the compass, but I've also got that liar, because sometimes the vintage liar, because sometimes I need to do a puzzle or two with the Aranara, and they still need that occasionally to do exploration. So what? We'll, that's what we're there. Wow, such a huge tree. Watch your step when you walk. Don't fix it on that tree, Miss Julie. Ah, I smell it, the aroma of delicacies. Just go and play somewhere and I'll catch up with you in a minute. No way, we must make sure everyone enjoys the savory meals. No one should be left out. You are unbelievable. Fine, the academia is up there. Let's get going. There's a reason why does she not want I do need to finish that particular for that quest line. Hi, Mr. Lath. Far far out walk, ten of mart. Actually, we'll go there. <laughs> it's the best way to chop in. 
collect these. Sparkle, sparkle, trail, sparkle, 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 sparkle. Sparkle. Farza. Haha. -ha. Par Parvana, you're back. I've been waiting for so long. Sorry I'm late, Miss Farza. Something happened to the way and it took me a while. No worries, your paper is well written and your research looks very promising too. I've heard a lot of good words about it. <coughs> Thank you. I've brought the whole paper with me. Well, great work, Parvana. I'll take a good look, good look at it later. With your academic ability, I'm sure there won't be any issue. You are too kind, Miss Farza. Did Parvana just blush? You don't see that every day. Is it really something to be proud of to be recognized by your mentor? Hmm. What's going on? What is it? I don't like that mentor of hers. And why is that, Miss Julie? I don't know. It's just a feeling. Maybe I'm too exhausted. Don't tell Parvana. I don't want to upset her. What are you guys talking about? Ugh, it's nothing. I'm starving. Haven't you eaten already? You really have a voracious appetite, don't you? Julie is not a sedentary person. Of course she gets hungry fast. Parvana has got all over your... Have you gotten it over with your business? Almost. I just have to wait for the paper to be formally reviewed, which should be completed in the next few days. After this, hmm, I can work on the projects that I like. The Omni Spice has not been refined. I shall perfect it when I have a whole team. I still have things to do before my paper gets approved. You should stay in Sumeru City. I can't afford any more time to look for you. No worries, the whole city is enough for a tour. Now that you've done here, how about you show us around? And some Sumeria local specialties, maybe. Finally, huh? I can see that look in your face. Look, at, look, look, let me see. Let's go with the headquarters of the Corpse of 30. Huh? 30 people? That can't be all they have. <laughs> it's just a name. Don't worry. Anyway, let's go and ha take a look. Julie, why are you silent? Something's wrong? Uh, no, 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 I'm just hungry. I'll be fine with some food. How do you even manage to stay in shape with that appetite? Hmm. We're going to the core of thirty. Core of thirty. There we go. This is the place. Stationed here is the Corps core of 30, responsible for the defense of Sumer City. The name came from its founders. There were exactly 30 of them. The entire Corps has expanded, but the name remains in memory of the founders. Like the Four Winds in Mondstadt. Pretty easy to understand. It's just like like the Liwei Chising in Liwei. Eh, why are you all looking at me? Hmm, we have the Tri Commission in Azuma. Regions have their names in a similar way. It appears so, but it's more than 30 people when we talk about the Koran 30 in Sumeru. The guard there looks like a martial artist. He looks really worried. Chill out, it's no serious business. Ah, you've come to Sumeru City for a visit. I'm Eunice, Logistic Officer of the Corps of Thirty in the Citadel of Vegzar. <coughs> you look worried. Ran into some trouble? It's the same bottle! <coughs> For clothing! Yes, monsters in the wild have been restless for reasons unknown. We've had to send someone to drive them away. They move so fast in large numbers, people we send deal with them get whacked every time. 
I was wondering what meals our cook should prepare for them. Ah, uh, it seems that another bunch of our men should be back now. Now, if you'll excuse me, ha have a good time in Sumeru City. What a man of action. Whew, I'm glad he didn't talk to me. I'm afraid of dealing with people from the Aramites. Mmm, the racism. Let me see. We'll head... To the Adventurer's Guild next. Though I don't think it would be very different from the guilds anywhere else. But Julie may want to see it. Huh? Julie? Huh? What was that? We were going to visit the Adventurer's Guild. Are you coming? Yeah, I've always wanted to visit there. Let's roll. Something's off with Julie. Something's off with Julie. <clears throat> What's wrong, Julie? This is the Adventurer's Guild? Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. Anything you're here for? Ah, you're looking to take a commission. Just ask Catherine over there. You seem dispirited, Julie. Are you feeling exhausted? Yeah, I'm a little tired. <clears throat> We hardly got any rest after getting off the ship, and I'm exhausted, too. We should get something to eat soon and turn in Penva uh, Parvana. That sounds good. Shiverme's Grill should still be open, so we ought to feast there. Let's roll. I didn't expect Sumeru City to be so big, and it wore me out just window shopping. Finally, local Sumeru delicacies. Can't wait. Oh, wrong direction. Thought it was going to take me there, but apparently not. Parvana, you're back. Are those your friends behind you? Yes, they just got to Samara and I've been showing them around the city. I saw your open and wanted to get some shawarma wraps. Got enough ingredients for us? Are you kidding me? Of course I do. Six rolls, one for each person, right? Give me a few minutes. Whoa, Paimon can't wait. The smell, the taste, it's heavenly. What an amazing flavor. Completely different from Inazuma's cooking. How is it, Julie? Delicious. Thanks. Why are you so polite all of a sudden? Are you feeling okay? So what's next? We reserve lodging and I'll check in soon. We'll leave Sumero after Parvana's thesis gets officially passed. Hold on. After her thesis is accepted, she will stay at the academia to do research work, so she can't come with us anymore. It's what she wants. She talked to us about it, and we all understand. That might be true, but it will feel like we're missing something. So that's why Julie seems distracted the whole way. That's probably the cause. Even though everyone's tried to avoid the subject, Parvana will likely remain in the academia. Come on, this is not the end of the world. It's not like we'll never see her again. We can even bum a meal off of the Actemio when we come back later. Parvana told us before that she kept in touch with her mentor, so she should get the result for her thesis in two or three days. Yeah, come back to the Academia tomorrow and hang out with us. Since we have no idea when the next time will be, af be after we leave Sumero. Aww voice sounded a little sad. Let's check back in with him tomorrow. Okay, we just need to do 8 o'clock tomorrow here. Oh, 
off to the academia. Where are you taking me? Actually, let's... Bum bum ba da da! Oh no. Shameless. She doesn't deserve the title of a researcher. Plagiarizing and deceiving, that's what she learned at the academia? How can Miss Parvana get scolded by such scum? Chill, Mr. Camway. This is the academia. The core authority is right down there. Try and think rash and we'll get busted. Hmm. If we were back in Indezuma, I'd let my bed do the talking. Why is everyone so angry? What's going on? Traveler, you wouldn't have come at the worst time. What's going on? She's over there. I'll brief you on what happened. Last night, we went back to the inn with Parvana for a little chat. Parvana was suddenly called away by a man from the academia who said something went wrong with her paper and she needed to discuss it with her mentor. Mentor. There we go. She was supposed to go alone, but we were a bit worried, so we went with her. We heard outside that the researcher Far Farja was talking to Parvana. They started arguing, and then Parvana came out, slammed the door, and bumped into us. She explained to us that her paper might have been plagiarized by Farza to make some deals with someone. We talked all night and couldn't come up with a good idea, so today we came with her to talk to Vars Farza again. Since Camway got really angry, we're staying here, while Julie has gone with Parvana. We could feel the tension in the air. Don't know how things are going over there. I'll never cooperate with you. I've told you that. Miss Parvana, I sincerely advise you to create consider. This is a win-win business. It's hard to come by. Win-win? I'm not trying to win. I didn't write this paper to make money. Hmm, this is not what we agreed on, Miss Farza. I'm not going to lie to you. You can get your research out to the public faster by working with Mr. Nede. Sounds like a liar. Stay away from Parvana. Or I won't be so polite. Hmm, Miss Farza, I presume something's wrong with the security. Security the academia, since when can an adventure come in and give us cheek? Julie, it's okay. Mr. Fa I never trade Omni Spice for even one Mora. Since I wrote the first word of this paper, I've told you I'll provide the research results to anyone in need for free. <sighs> Why won't you just listen? See, I told you it would come to this. It's all right, Miss Parvana. You can rest assured I won't make it difficult for you. Even if you don't want to work with me, we'll find another way. Oh, he just threatened her. Parvana, are you alright? This is bad. Those two, they must have been planning this for a while. My mentor, no. Farja has had her eyes on my spice from the start. No wonder she was always so eager to discuss my paper with me. Now she's developed a whole new project based on my paper and made another seasoning to sell. What do we do? It's practically impossible for us to stop her from making an advance. Omni Spice. Looks like there's no other choice. We can only go with my dumb idea. We already have. You already have an idea? Of course not. It look took us all night to figure it out. Yes, I'm a chef, but I started out as a restaurant owner in Leeway. Leeway Harbor, and I know a trick or two about running a business. Parva br Parvana briefed me with some of the details. I think I know how Farza will make money off of Omni Spice. Those two misers will have to keep the spice formula to themselves if they want to make any money. And my stupid way is the exact opposite of their plan, and that's to give the formula away to the public for free first. If everyone had the formula for free, a few would buy it when Nettie tries to sell it. But how do you give it to people out there? My, my guess is the Gourmet Supremos do best. We make meals with all the ingredients and spices. Are you saying you're going to spread the formula by making dishes with it? 
but Parvana's research. It's okay. It's just some dumb paper, no worries. I had intended to give the Omni Spice formula to everyone for free with my resources at the academia anyway. Nothing wrong with giving the formula away at the most straight in the most straightforward way. Parvana Miss Parvana Parvana is indeed a true researcher at the academia. What an answer. Then let's do what we planned last night. Nitty might have drummed up many to help him sell the formula. We must get ahead of him. Julie, please ask the Adventures Guild for a list of villages that demand a lot of hard labor. Fishing, lumber, or hunting, as long as it takes toil. Leave it to me. Mr. Camway, please help us collect spices we're going to need for cooking dishes. I'll take care of, care of that. Miss Parvane has told me where to find Harifruit. I know I can rely on you, traveler. Could you help Mr. Camway find Harifruit? Leave it to me. We'll leave it in your hands, then. Parvane and I will go back to the inn and figure out the menu, and when we're ready, we'll meet you there. Traveler, let me show you the show you the rendezvous. Let's roll. I didn't expect to have such fun in Sumeru City. This trip is really worth my t Yeah, but new friend. Her from the map glows in the south side. Okay. No, I went the map. Okay, we'll start here. Got to get us a little closer. Oh, there's a couple of things over here. Let's <coughs> get them while I'm over here. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Fishy, fishy is mine. Should be over here. Let's split up and end this quickly. I just noticed there are traces of monsters around. We could run into monsters if we keep going. Please be careful. Please rendezvous with me once you have the hair of fruit. I'll be counting on you then. Well, I plan on fighting some of them. Okay. I don't want to fight you. But getting those lotuses are always a good thing because I've got <laughs> the characters to level, so let's go grab them. Hello. 
I'll grab them. No. Where? <laughs> mm -hmm. Sorry, I haven't found any Hara fruit. Anything on your end? Great, these should be enough. I need to gather some other ingredients nearby, Traveler. Please go back and check with Miss Julie. Check on Miss Julie. I keep for ah! Okay. Physical labor, if I must, I say Vimara Village, Caravan Rabat, and Port Ormos. Vimara has farmers. Caravan Rabat and Port Ormos have a lot of menial labors, too. But why do you want to know? Got a job to offer? A good friend of mine asked me to do look into this. I see. Let's mark the locations on the map for you. They're all quite a ways from the city, so try not to get lost. Thank you. How'd it go? Thanks to this mister's help, we got the locations. The rendezvous is not far from here, traveler. Let's hurry. Thank you, Kamal. Let's talk to this dude. Thank you, Mr. Cammy. The Cammy Cammy, the ingredients should be enough. Par Parvana and I have decided the menu. We only need to wait for Julie to tell us where to make the meals. We're back. Great. Did you get any information? We better go to the Vimara Village, Caravan Ravat. They're all marked on the map. Sweet, we've got no time to waste. Let's visit Vim Vim the the Vimara Village first. Ah, no. Okay, there's that. That one.
Nabati. Let's talk to her, this one. Him. Field trip again? Provena, are you, why are you here? Didn't you go back to the academia to submit your paper? And why are there a bunch of people behind you? What is all of this? Well, it's a long story. She tells the body what has happened. Food for marketing, that's new. But how could Farja do this? It doesn't make sense. There's no news of her project being suspended. And she is getting paid as usual. Why are we doing business with, with a Fontaine guy? Anyway, that's the situation. Come and help me. Think about the tons of paperwork you copied, homework you copied from me. I didn't copy from you. Don't forget, you referenced my outline. Old acquaintances we've got here. <clears throat> Hi there, I'm Nabati. I do research on the human body in Amurda. Amur 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 ah, though my project hasn't been approved. We went to the academia together long ago, but we didn't really work together since we were studying different subjects. Thank God we didn't. I would have choked on your weird dishes. Don't stare at me like that. Let's get down to business. I want to make dishes that appeal to the local taste of Vimara Village, right? Any thoughts? Vimara is located the very, in a very convenient spot. It's a key area along the waterway to Sumeru. And if you get along the waterway, you get to Port Ormos. And most ships dock at Port Ormos. Hard laborers like loading cargo and repair work are mostly done in Port Ormos. Over time, many people went to work there. Now only elders and kids stay at the village. And slackers like me, of course. Do you know what kind of food the folks like here? Mm, light meals, I guess. And fish is a regular dish here. This place is so far away from the city that seasonings are hard to buy. Sometimes the dishes are incredibly bland. The elders couldn't tell the difference, but I just couldn't stand it. A peculiar guy from Fontaine did try to sell the spice you mentioned, but the residents here simply couldn't afford it. <laughs> That'd be great for you to try Parvena's Omni Spice. Let's go back to business, Mr. Kame. Julie, please help me set up the pot. Mr. Nabati, I'm now introducing to you the amazing Omni Spice. Any dish with this Omni Spice will have a delicious taste. If you don't believe me, you could try the fish with cream sauce made with this Omni Spice. Traveler, please help us find some fresh fish and drop it off to Parvane. I will go through the recipe to a few more times. Just check this recipe five times. Oof, hopefully we can make it right. Ooh. Why am I going somewhere? Oh, it's because I don't need to catch any fish. Go ahead. Take the fish. My hard iron to fish. Everything is ready. I've just checked the recipe twice more. Seven times in total. There won't be any problems. If there's any problem, I f I'll find a way out. All right, show's on. This is delicious, and it doesn't seem to have any special spices. That's what makes the Omni Spice so special. It brings out the flavor in the food, giving it an amazing taste. More importantly, the Omni Spice is not too difficult to make. How much is this Omni Spice? I'd like to buy some to try. I'll give you the formula. Since you are a researcher, I'm sure you can make one on your own. Wait, you're just giving it to me like that? This could sell for a lot of mora. That Fontaine peddler put a high price on the spice. And you're not happy about it? Take it and be sure to share it with others. Don't just use it for your own food. Okay, Parvana, you are crazy. I think I am too, but it's a good to be crazy once in a while. Anyways, the formula is in your hands. Remember to share. Since we can head to Port Ormos via the waterway, let's go there next. Yeah, let's go. The waterway. Be oops. Oh, hold on. 
I could probably just... Boom. There. <clears throat> Boom. Let's talk to this guy. We're back to Port Ormos again. So many people here. Where do we even start? How about I beat someone in a duel and then recommend this by... That's not how you do it, sir. Someone in the first place. Eh, where did Yudong go? Whoa, so many Port Steve doors and leeway. Yeah, we've got... We get whacked every time we finish unloading. Since when did we start chit-chatting with that guy? One of you Yudong's talents, I guess. Oh, life is so hard, especially when you have to cook for yourself after getting off of work. I feel exhausted just thinking about it. Not for me. I have a special spice that can easily help me make delicious meals. Huh. What are you here to peddle goods like the Fontaine guy? I don't have time for this. I'd rather just give me an offer like the Fontaine offer vendor did. And just to be clear, I don't have much in my pocket to handle some spicy, fancy spice. Uh-oh, busted. Wait, our spice is nothing like that Fontaine guy was selling to you. We'll make a dish with the spice for you to try. For free. That way you'll see how good the spice is. This is too good to be true. Chefs are generous. Traveler, please help me. Please let me find two potatoes and drop them off to... Parvana. Hmm, let me think about making a potato boat for this mister. I don't think I need to go find potatoes because I believe I have a couple of taters. Taters, are you going to take my taters? Yep, I got the ingredients. I have a lot of potatoes. Okay, that's fair. You can have two of them. You can have two of my taters. What you do? Let me heat the pot up. Finished already? Where's the spicing? Like I said, with the Omni Spice, any dish can become a delicious one. This must cost a pile of Mora. The Fontaine Paddler put a high price on his spice, too. Here, this is the formula of Omni Spice. It's easy to prepare. You can make some back home. What do you mean? You don't want any Mora? We want nothing from you. Instead, we kindly ask that you share this formula to the public. Well, you got it for free. It'd be nice to give it to others as a free favor, wouldn't it? That makes sense. Thanks. Judong's got quite a way with words. Paimon didn't see that before. That's one of my skills. A chef must master. You can't take care of customers of all kinds without a silver tongue, can you? It's hard to be a chef in Leeway Harbor. <laughs> okay, our final stop will be Caravan Rabat. Parva said she knows Mariam, owner of Gil of, a, of Gilded Journey, and she told her about our spice marketing. Let's hope it goes well this time, too. Ah. Caravan of that. Let's go. Miriam, you're finally back. I thought you'd give up halfway through. <clears throat> I heard from Parvana you tried to give the spice away for free in response to that Fontaine guy. What a stupid idea for an Akinamia researcher. Ahem. Sorry, the idea came from me. I'm a chef. Hmm, since I know Parvana, I can help you promote this Omni Spice. You must have been tired after all the work. Hey, chef. The ingredients are already in the kitchen, and there's a fire in a pot outside. You can cook something any time, and take good rest when you're done. The lady researcher must be tired, even if you are not. I dare not refuse it. Traveler, could you please help me gather some party salas? It's certainly been a long day for everyone, and I want to prepare a fine meal to treat everybody. What? You're going to take my party salas? No, I need those. I need those. 
Ah! Fine. Leave it to me. Oh, prepare the rest of the party Sarah's the ingredients. When you get the party Sarah's, please give them to Par Parvana. Thank you, Traveler. I have them. I don't want to give you any. Where are these guys? There they are. Oh, you want three of them? Oh, fine. Because I need to work on my characters that need them. Ah! Oh, that's all good. What did you make? It's a tandoori roast chicken. Ah! It sounds weird, but it does have a good taste. When did, it, when did you learn to cook, like, cook this? I've never seen you do that before. Flick through the recipe yesterday. It's in my mind now. You are such an exceptional chef, Mr. Zhudong. I might have been able to speed up my research if I had known you sooner. That net knitted guy seems to be exactly where we're going, and he's always one step ahead of us. He didn't seem to be able to sell any spice, but why has been why has he been keeping pace with us? I don't have a good feeling about that knitted guy. <clears throat> I guess you're well rested. Take this letter. The netty guy from Fontaine asked me to give it to you. Why did he give it to you? The guy's left. He paid me to prepare the ingredients and wait for you to come. He told me to give you the letter after you've been rested. Sorry I'm not telling you this, but he paid him a lot. Hmm. Hmm. What does it say? Bunch of sentimental crap. He said his business to talk with us about the academia. Hmm. I guess that scum's had enough and is appealing to arms. It would actually be better if that were the, was the case. Well, if Nettie said so, we're going there for a meetup. Traveler, could you come with us for another trip? Uh, yeah, I'll teach him a lesson. <laughs> I'll be looking forward to it then. Yeah, that guy's going to get a lesson he'll never forget. Then let's go going. Time to see what this guy wants. Ba, 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 ba. No. Ah. Ah. No, this is not exactly super interesting. I mean, it's interesting for me, but oh, I'm not sure how interesting I can make this. I'm not good at doing different voices on the spot. Mm. Welcome, welcome, everyone. I've been waiting for you. Yeah, you. The. What are you up to? Stay away. Easy, Miss Adventure. I don't wish to fight you, nor do I have the ability to. Your plan has worked. Your free spice is taking over the market. It'll be even harder for me to promote a new spice. You've won this one. Please go easy on this poor businessman. You're lying through your teeth. I have never met a man more loathsome than you. <laughs> it seems like you haven't dealt with many businessmen then. You are not with Far Far Farza? She might be working... On her new formula. Lo she might be working on a new formula. Locked herself in her room and won't come out. But to be honest, I really don't care about this. You know, I did tons of work just to skirt around some some boring clauses. And she wouldn't even get down from her high horse as a researcher. I also had to find resources to promote her spice because she refused to do it herself. I was wrong. She's not the right pick for a business partner. But now I think you're, the, you're, you're perfect for business. I... You have plans and are willing to get your hands dirty. Plus, you have decent, pretty decent skills. Are you here to cause trouble? Relax. I just want to ask. Are there any opportunities for me to invest in you? What? Do you know what you're talking about? 
You are so unpredictable. Yeah. Well, he is a businessman. He realized that that was a losing game with the other lady. So. Humph, liar. Are you serious? Of course I am. What makes you think I am not? The fact that you were working with the shady... Your spice formula is taking root on the market, enjoying popularity and reputation among customers. The formula Miss Farza is making will be of higher quality, but it is somewhat difficult to promote. And I know you're not willing to cooperate with her. So here's my offer. I'll invest in your spice and organize resources for the business. Part of the profits I made from Miss Farza's formula will be used to promote your formula for free. And the rest of the profits will be all yours. I do have to pay... You don't have to pay a single mora. You just need to put my trademark on the back of your formula. That's shady as hell. What did you? What do you say? I say no. I've told you before. I don't want anything from you. And why would you even want to invest in our formula? Miss Farza is, is a more experienced researcher who has way more resources than me. Experiences, resources, those can be improved in many ways. But you cannot build your world, word of mouth like that overnight. I think I've said too much. Well, I guess that's it for today. I have to go back and see if Miss Farza is starving in her lab. I will stay in Sumeria for some time. I seriously, I sincerely look forward to working with you one day. So long. I hope Farza continue. Like, Farza, uh, pa, pa, whatever, pa, 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 whatever. Panny says no. I'm so sick of him. He could be more tricky than monsters. Farza, net it. I guess the whole thing is not as simple as we had hoped for. It looks like we won't be able to leave Sumera for now. We must look into this. <sighs> I just wanted to do my research. Why did it get why did I get into this mess? <sighs> it's what it is. A restaurant must be cleaned before it can be opened to customers. Don't worry, we'll get to the bottom of this. Traveler, it looks like we're gonna team up again. We might still need your help in the future. Sure. That's the spirit. But what is this Nede plotting? Good question. Yeah, that was that one. That one within our duties. Oh, this is the last quest. Oh no! Mm, okay. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I think, I think I've, yeah, I think I'm going to call it a day. It's been kind of meh. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end today's stream. I will see you guys all tomorrow. Um, have a wonderful rest of your day, evening, night, wherever you may be, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.